Hi, so today we'll see how you can create an official email account from your domain name using cPanel. I see a lot of people, they're using Gmail IDs and Yahoo or a Hotmail ID even when they have their domain name registered. So if you have your website running, you have your domain name, why don't you use your email ID which comes with your domain name? I'm going to show you how you can do this just in few clicks. Before we move forward, I would like to tell you in this channel, I give a lot of important tips and tricks that how you can create your website, how you can manage your website and how you can add user functionality to your website. So if you're new here, you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, consider subscribing it. It will make your life very easy when it comes to manage your website. So let's go into my screen and I show you how you can create the official email ID which comes with your domain name using cPanel. So first of all, you need to log into website cPanel and then from your search bar, search for email and then you'll find this option email accounts. Click on email accounts. So you can see if already there's an email ID created on your website, you will see all these email IDs here. I already have few email ID created. But if you want to create a new email ID, just click here on create. It will ask you domain name to choose. If you have multiple domain name, you can select the option from here. If you have just domain name, it will by default selected here. So I'll keep continue using igniterpro.com and then I'll create the email ID admin at dateignitepro.com and then set the security password. You can generate a highly safe password from here also. And then you can select the storage space 200 MB or 200 GB. Depending your website hosting capacity, it can be different. Then your option to automatically create folders for plus addressing. You can just leave it default by automatically create folders and then leave it checked to send a welcome email with the instruction to set up a mail client and then click on create. So that was everything how you create an email ID. You can see here our email ID is created. If you want to check email, you can just click here check email. It will take you to your email account and you need to log in with the username and the password you created and then you can check all the emails. If you want to change something, do you want to change password or something, you can click on manage. You can change the security password or the storage data for this email ID. Or you can just put the restriction also. If you're receiving incoming emails, you can allow or suspend. Outgoing email, you can do all the same thing. Allow, suspend, hold and logging in also. And in the end, we have connect devices option. Click on connect devices. Here's the instruction. How you can configure this email ID in different mail clients. How you can configure it in Outlook or with a Gmail account or on your Android or your iPhone mail client. This is how you create an email ID for your website which comes with the official domain name. One thing I want to tell you that in some hosting, email accounts are not free. Most of the hosting or domain name, you get the free email accounts. So if they are not free, just consult with your hosting or your domain provider. You can have free email accounts, otherwise you have to pay. So this was everything. I hope you also created your email account and you start using it instead of using Gmail or Yahoo account. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. And when you give this video a thumbs up, it can reach to a lot of other audience who are looking for this kind of information I'm making here on YouTube. So thank you so much. Have a nice day. See you in another video.